calling these women or texting them, asking them what they doing. They doing rent, light bill, water bill, car insurance, life insurance, pampers, and milk. Fuck what I'm doing. Send me a cash app. Yeah. And these are the type of women that a lot of black women are influenced by. And you wonder where they get it from. And she got it from her mama. That's what it is. I just made a video today about the whole welfare welfare system. Some footage from 1973. If you guys want to check that out, you should check that out. It should be below, somewhere below this video here. But this attitude, this is exactly what is described in that video. See, a man can't even be polite and say, how you doing? What you doing? What you do? what you up to? Friendly conversation. I don't worry about what I'm up to. I'm up to paying bills. I'm up to this. What you going to give? Send me a cash app. Oh, you ain't got cash app? Send me Venmo. Send me PayPal. Oh, I got zeal. Because you need to send me some money. Matter of fact, won't you bring over a meal for me, my mama, my grandkids, my kids, my sister's kids? Because that's what you're supposed to do. Don't ask me how I'm doing. Ask me what you're going to tell me what you're going to do for me. This is the type of attitude that they have. And they think nothing is wrong with it. And a lot of times, there's a lot of young black boys in these situations with these women and they have to survive in that not only will they grow up to have a lot of angst towards men in general especially black men but they will grow up with hardly any masculine influence which will make them more feminine which will make them more emotional which will make some of them more dangerous. Some of them in situations that they shouldn't be in. Choices making decisions that they shouldn't make from their emotions. Because that's all they learned from women was emotions and being emotional. So this has an adverse effect on children. This has been happening for decades, generations. This is a big part of the problem that is in the black community right now you have this elderly woman sending this message out right in front of her family right in front of some kids and putting it live on social media so you wonder you shouldn't wonder anymore why we have so many issues in the black community because it's all about money you have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.